these mountains are confusing, they're steep, and they're loose. And that differentiates them from a lot of the other 14ers. And if you're not ready for that, uh, you may need some help. There are some peaks in this state that, uh, you know, if you haven't done it, a uh, class three or a class four, that's probably the time to hire a guide. I would say if you're coming to town from far away and you, you don't have a community to access with uh, other available partners, consider hiring a guide. Why wouldn't you want to go with someone who actually works up there on the route for a living? Um, they know how to do it and they do it safely. I think that here in the U.S. we have a big do-it-yourself mentality and people don't seek instruction as much as they do elsewhere, say in Europe, hiring professional guides to gain skill sets and experience in the mountains is status quo. Everybody does it. As a young climber, before I started guiding and had experience in the mountains, I hired guides all over the place. So when you are on a guided climb, you don't have to think about the route finding. We always take the safest lines. We are extremely dialed in mountain weather and the way that the systems work here in the mountains. Some folks would like to be tied into a rope the entire route, and other folks would like to just be shown the correct route and be left a little more to their own. Uh, there's no hard, fast rule on, on how you would be handled by a guide, but you could look at it as a, as a learning experience where they could show you technique and safety and all their tricks along the way while also getting you to the summit, hopefully, in a safe way. A lot of the clients that we get are people who have climbed all of the 14ers, except in the Elk Mountains, and we usually finish their 54 14ers here in the Elk Mountains with them. It's still hard work, and if you're a curious client, they're gonna share with you how they made their did their decision making and give you the beginnings of the skills you need to do that kind of stuff on your own. I think that hiring a guide is a really important part of the progression of mountain climbing. You can gain basic skill sets that would make you so much more comfortable and move so much more safely through this terrain.